Using either Summon or Google Scholar, you can easily find out the types of activities that you can do with electronic resources available through the library. This short video will show you how to use this new resource. So first, let's find an article. For this example, I'm going to use the article LC or the Library of Congress Gets Twitter Archive. So to quickly find this article in Summon from the main library page, click on Advanced Search and then type the title LC Gets Twitter Archive in the with the words in this title field. So, and then click search. So you'll see that my article is the only entry here. So to access this article, click on the title. So on this page, you will see a number of different databases that will include full text of this article. Now what is new is that now some of the databases will include a summary of their terms of use under their entry. So um, using this menu you can quickly find out how you can use this article. So if e-reserve is a yes, you can include this article into an e-reserve system. If CMS is a yes, you can download the article and re-upload it to a learning management system like Moodle. If course pack is a yes, um, you can put the article in a course pack. If link is a yes, you can put a link into this article. If ILL is a yes, it can, this article can be used for interlibrary loan. And if print is a yes, you can print a copy for your own research or private study. And if distribute is a yes, you can provide a copy to a colleague for personal use. And if you want more information about any of these um, fields, just click through and you'll be taken to a page with more information.